When Gladys Berejiklian became Premier in early 2017, this Wagga Wagga shooting proposal had just been given conditional approval by the powerful expenditure review committee she chaired. A range of conversations at that time indicated that uh, the, the Premier, the Premier's office were particularly interested in this particular project. But in April that year, it failed a test to prove it had sufficient benefit to justify its cost. A senior bureaucrat said his department was instructed by the then Deputy Premier John Barillaro's office to do further work to get it over the line. I understood it to be the interest of the Premier herself. How did you understand it to be, or what was the basis for your understanding that there was interest from the Premier herself? The, uh... The, the way in uh, which this was uh, brought to my attention as a priority project to me indicated that this wasn't just casual interest from an advisor in the Premier's office. But Chris Hanger made clear nothing was overinflated to make it pass the test. Stuart Ayres, who was the sports minister when this proposal was under consideration, will give evidence tomorrow. It's expected he'll be pressed about why he changed his mind about the Clay Target Association's proposal, which he'd initially declined to fund. He isn't accused of any wrongdoing. Daryl Maguire will be back in the witness box on Wednesday, followed by Ms Berejiklian next Thursday and Friday. Kathleen Coldwood, ABC News, Sydney.